Welcome to the tutorial for adding a content toggle to a page, a content page or a blog page. First of all I wanted to show you exactly what I meant by a content toggle. Um, essentially a content toggle is a container that you can put some text into on your page and it will allow um, it to actually sit inside a toggle that the reader can expand or collapse so that they can actually view the extra content in there. So this is really, really useful if you have a very long page of content and you want to shorten it a bit and there might be some subsidiary information that's useful for the person to be able to read, um, but you don't really want to make it a really, really long and kind of daunting page for them to look at initially when they open it. Okay, so this is a content toggle right here that I'm demonstrating now. All right, so I'm gonna go over to my test website and just demonstrate how to actually add this. So I'm on my about page of my test website and I'm going to go into my WordPress editing area and I have my page open here and ready to edit. Okay, so I am going to highlight this paragraph here. So let's just say I want that paragraph there to be in a content toggle. Once you've highlighted the text, go to your blue WooThemes drop down menu and then select content toggle from that menu just there. That is going to bring up a window with lots of different options in there. Um, one of the most useful is actually putting a title on it. So here you can see the default is open me and close me. So that's just giving the reader a little bit of extra guidance on exactly what to do when they see this on the page. Um, so I am going to put under open me instead, click, click here to read more information. Okay, and then under the close me, this is actually the uh, title that they will see when the content or toggle is expanded and they're actually reading it. So I'm going to say here more information about a test page. Okay, oh, my spelling is terrible tonight. There we go. Right, um, there's a number of different other options you've got down here and you can really play around with these. It's all about the formatting and how it's actually going to display and you really can't do anything wrong here. So I would just encourage you to have a little play around and see what these actually do. Um, for instance, you can put a border on or actually have no border. Um, you can have different styles for the toggling. You can make it white. Um, you can change the excerpt length so, so you can um, actually show a little bit of, bit of the text before someone actually expands it to see a little bit more about it. So yeah, as I say, um, all um, optional extras which I really encourage you to play around with. Okay, once you are ready uh, to actually insert that, just click the insert button. And as you'll see, there is now some code on your page. So there's a toggle tag on here and just at the start of this paragraph as well. And as you can see, there's um, some information about this test page, etc., etc. That was my title I actually typed in there. Now I'm gonna click update. So that saves my changes. And if I go back to the view page, now we can see I have a content toggle and I can expand that to see the paragraph that I just spoke about. Okay, so I hope that's been helpful. Please do drop me an email and let me know if um, I can improve this video at all or if you need any other videos. Uh, my email address is mail at kerrywilliams.net. Thank you.